Hey guys, Jay's Two Cents here, and I picked myself up a brand new power supply. My Thermaltake TR2 just wasn't cutting it anymore. I was getting a lot of voltage drop. So I wanted to step this up, and I went with a 80 plus gold series Corsair AX750. So we're gonna do an unboxing of this. I've never done an unboxing video before, so I don't really know what to expect here. But I wanna say right off the bat, I picked this up at my local Fry's in Anaheim, California. And I got it for an incredible price. I got it for 135 bucks brand new, and it comes with a $10 rebate, so $125 in the end. And looking at New Egg right now, it's $169.99 with a $15 rebate, making it $154.99 in the end. Plus you have to pay shipping on that. So. I got a hell of a deal on this. I just couldn't pass it up considering everything else in the same price range was a, a bronze rated. So every single connector, it's kind of hard to see. I don't know if you can see that right here. You can see it on the front here for sure. Every connector is modular. So you're not stuck with this bundle of wires coming out, you know, this big clump of wires and then some modular. Everything is modular on this. This is a 750 watt unit. I bumped it up from 650. I'm using a 650 now, but you know, 750 is more than enough if I decide to SLI my 680 in the future because they're so efficient. But I am a fan of single graphics cards just because of the simplicity. So I'll probably just stick with 750 at the most here. It is a gold rated, so I am gonna get a full 750 if I need it. Um, but what I like about this power supply here is that, you know, it does have a PM, PWM fan in it. So the fan speed, as you can see right here, does ramp up with load, but you've got uh, two of the eight pins you've got four of the pci express you got 12 sata connectors oh my god um eight of the four pin peripheral or the molex and then you've got two of the floppy drives don't need that here you've just got your general information all different languages um but yeah that's pretty much it here this showing the efficiency here and this is the fan chart and then just showing you here you know here's your outputs here your dc output max load Okay, so let's go ahead and cut this thing open here. So we can do it without cutting myself. My wife doesn't normally let me near sharp things. We always seem to end up in the ER. I want to make this a true unboxing. So many people will open it up first and then put it all back in the box. And, uh, you know, then it's not really an unboxing because an unboxing is supposed to be, you know, your first impressions of the way it's packed, the presentation from the company. You know, as well as make the person feel like they just bought it and what are they getting for their money here. So, and we've got another another level of security here. So that's good. There we go. All right. So you got your manual here. You got 650, 7850, and 1200. I was actually looking for a 650. They didn't have any in stock. So I just went ahead and went with the 750. Didn't mind having a little bit of overhead there. Um, that's a manual. I'm a man. I don't read that. Nice, very heavy gauge power supply uh, wall plug here. This is much heavier than the one I'm using now. I might just switch that out. They give you some zip ties as well as a Corsair, powered by Corsair sticker on there. It's kind of cool. It's got some black um, screws right here for you to use to connect it to your case. And here I'm imagining this is going to be all of our cables. It's got this nice bag. Oh, the sleeving on these are nice. So this here is our... Uh, looks like this is our PCI Express 8-pin. Another PCI Express. So, yeah, these are all our cables here. Interestingly enough, these SATA cables are not sleeved. However, it appears that everything else might be. No. So the Molex and the SATA cables are not sleeved, but the PCI Express ones are. So go figure on that one. Nice styrofoam packing right here for the power supply. Power supply comes in a bag. There's nothing else in the box down there. Let's go ahead and loosen this up eh, it's not too big it's nice and heavy though nice 
the whole back is a grill, so you got nice cooling features there. It's your 120 millimeter fan on the top, nice Corsair logo. Uh, and there's all your modular connections. So as you can see, there are no wires coming out of here whatsoever. Let's move that out of the way. So here's your 24 pin. Interesting. So apparently it comes with a different connector for the uh, 1200 because this is labeled a 650 through 850 AX only. All right, so there you go. That's the AX750 power supply, the gold series from Corsair. So check me out next time when I unbox the AF 140 millimeter case fan from Corsair. That is uh, rumored to be one of the best fans that you could possibly get right now next to the Gentle Typhoons. So can't wait to see how that one performs. All right, take care, guys.